Hey everyone, Mike Sherry here with Paul Sherry Used Cars. Behind me, I've got a people mover. This is a 2021 Ford Transit, 12 passenger, high roof. And this is on the 350 Transit chassis, 140 inch, 148 inch wheelbase. So from that wheel to the back wheel, 148 inches. Uh, reason we do these videos is we recognize no two pre-owned vehicles are the same. So we like to uh, do a video to give you a better idea of what you're looking at and possibly thinking about purchasing. So uh, I'll point out the defects as I see them and uh, hopefully aid in your buying decision, whether you're here in the town where we sell vehicles in Ohio or maybe all the way across from Washington State, uh, you again get a good idea of what you're purchasing. So uh, stay tuned. Let's start the review. First off, I like to check the front windshield for uh, splits and things. I don't see any. Looks good up there. Uh, this does have, I think it's the 3.5 V6 in it. That's what they're putting in these. Got fog lights down below, headlights. It even has the parking sensors uh, and a little bit of even in the side. So you're going to get some side sensoring there when you go to park, which is nice on a bigger vehicle like this to have them in the front. And of course, it's going to have them in the back uh, for safety reasons there. Uh, coming down here, it's got, uh, let's see, the wheel size 16 inches and a good amount of tread left on the tires. It's got uh, disc brakes there, uh, an alloy wheel, and uh, look at all that tread left, a lot of tread. So not an expense you're going to have there uh, anytime soon. Uh, let's see here if I left it unlocked. I was second guess. Yep, I sure did. So it's got the running board, help you get up in there. And what you got, let's just do a count here. We got one seat driver's seat two, three in this for a total of five, three in this row here for eight, and then come back here into the back row, and there's four here, so that equals 12. Uh, now each seat has their uh, own seat belt, You've got beverage holders, USB, just about on every wall, so you got spot for the, the guests to charge their phones and things like that, the passengers which makes it nice black carpeting in here. So it's gonna wear really well. Uh, we do got rear heat and air conditioning controls back here for the rear passengers. So when you get a big van like this, they can't rely on just the dash here. Uh, you're gonna need rear heat and air conditioning decks, a little bit of bulkhead storage there. You notice the ducts all through the roof line. Now they make, Ford Transit makes this also in a low roof, which, uh, so let me get back here. I'm standing up. I, my, my head is touching the steel. I'm slightly crouched in this. So it's probably like 5'8 to 5'10 interior height here because I'm six foot and I'm just crouching down just slightly. But a low roof, it's going to cut off about right here. So that's a significant uh, amount difference there from the low roof to the high roof fans. Just in headroom and getting back those back seats, that's pretty important to me having the high roof fan. Now, uh, any of these rows of chairs or the individual ones like right here are removable. There's just quick uh, disconnects. Just pull them right here uh, and you can actually take the seat out of the van. Uh, maybe you've got something big you want to store in its spot or you're cleaning, whatever you might be doing. We got a little bit of a tenting to the back windows here. Uh, provides, uh, you know, uh, sun protection and also uh, a little bit of safety protection there too. Uh, so yeah, let's come up here and look. It's got the backup camera. It's actually built into that uh, plastic uh, third brake light right up there. Uh, this is the Transit, again, the 110, which is their uh, largest series here, and it is an XLT. Now they make this in an XL as well, not XLT. XLT has got more options than the XL is going to be the difference. So XL T is the top of the line transit. They notice the parking sensors here in the bumper and also the side detection there. Uh, so that makes it nice. Uh, being a one ton, you are capable to tow with this and it has your two inch towing receiver and all your applicable towing wiring, which is handy. Um, let's open this up here. So what I like about this long van is you get, you get storage here. So um, a lot of times some of the seats come right back here and there's no room for any luggage. And you got this many people, you're gonna have some stuff you're bringing along with them. So you got storage here. Again, those seats can be removed. You can see how this section or this section can be removed or both. So that's, that's handy there. Uh, no weird smells inside the van. You know we get those questions too. Uh, financing is also available on this. Body on this really looks excellent condition. I don't see any body damage. If there is, it's very minor. Um, 
Again, financing is available, so if you're interested in financing, one way where we're super transparent is we'll actually uh, get your information, you fill it out online, and we'll send it to the banks, let you know where you're at. There's no cost to do that, no obligation, uh, anything like that. So you got your blind spot monitoring, uh, double mirror there. Uh, fuel goes right in there, and I like how it's capless, so you don't have to mess with the cap. It's all sealed up without the cap. Airbags built into the seats. Up front here, let's go ahead. It drives really nice. Uh, it's got 24,029 miles on it. No warning lights or anything on the dash. This should still be under factory warranty. Uh, automatic headlights, got power mirrors. Um, let's see here. Yeah, power fold in mirrors too. It's kind of handy. Park on the street or something like that. And then let's see here. They fold out, just push down. Oh, a lot of beverage spots in here. So. Uh, you got spots up here, 12 volt power, USB power, you plug in your phone and stuff. Uh, kind of catch all on the door, steering wheel. You got radio controls, cruise control, all that. The radio here, let's put it in reverse. That backup camera is really nice. I like because it's a high up, like I showed you in the back, you get a nice aerial down. And it's got a zoom feature here, which gives you more of a straight down shot. So if you're like backing up to a trailer or something like that, that's handy. Uh, AM, FM radio, let's see here. If it's got, yeah, it's got Sirius XM as well. Uh, navigation, it's got factory navigation in there. So yeah, that all looks good. Parking sensors, traction control, things like that right there. Heat and air conditioning controls. Uh, and then the back heat and air, you can control right up here. So easy access for both of those. Automatic transmission, I think it's 10 speeds in this. So double check me on that, but I'm pretty sure 10 speed automatic transmission. Buffer, phone, beverages, all right there. I did pull up the history report. I, I always recommend, one of my top recommendations is to pull up a history report on any pre-owned vehicle you're interested in. Uh, so it shows you a lot of pertinent information. One, this one shows it's a one owner. Two, accident information. That's important to me. Uh, no accidents on this one. And then title information, if there's any like title issues, uh, that's going to show up in here. So uh, there is none on this. So it's clean uh, report right there. Uh, we post these on our website. Just look for the auto check emblem on the page of the vehicle you're looking at. So as always, thanks for hanging out with me. Uh, looks like this has lane assist too. I just noticed that. Uh, a lot of nice cool features on this. If you've got a, a lot of people to move, uh, this would be a good vehicle for you. I know my uh, roommate in college had 12 in his family. So uh, if you need a, a lot of people to move, something like this might be the best option for you. And we'd love an opportunity to earn your business. As always, call before you come. These vehicles uh, do sometimes stay online longer than they're actually for sale, particularly on YouTube and things like that, where it's harder to get the information off online. So as always, thanks so much for hanging out with me. If you like our honest sales approach and our transparency, just let me know down in the comments. If you want to see more, as always, subscribe and we'll hang out again. Take care.